everyone, I'm Alicia and I'm a radiographer. What I'm going to do today is go through the screening process of the lead increase that we have. So if you guys follow me over here. So what I'm going to do first of all is just remove this out of the way. We're going to screen this lead increase here. As a radiographer, what we're going to do first is just look for any obvious holes in the lead apron. We also want to look for any like openings like this for infection control purposes. It's not great, so really with this lead we probably might get rid of it because we do work with the so it's not ideal. And then once we've checked over the lead, we want to make sure that we're not holding it, freezing it at any point. So once we've checked it over, we'll spread it out. And we'll start screening. Leave it like that. So we've got the screen over here. Enable the x-rays. And then increase the field of view because we don't want to be radiating too much. We also want to reduce the scatter a little bit. So bring the detector down, take all the way up. And we'll start at the top. And we'll screen, so we'll use low quality radiation, so we'll just do a little more uh, back to the table, not really interested in that. And I'm just going to check for any holes, so those are normal, that's just stitching, we'll screen all the way at the bottom, go across, and the table a little bit. That's a fold in the apron, so what we're doing in this case is we would move it across so that we can see it properly. We want the beds to be nice and flat. And then we continue. We continue screening until you've gone through all the bed. If you do find any holes, it, you wouldn't necessarily condemn it or get rid of it. You would just put a mark on the lead where, where the hole is. Because if it's at the back, for example, and right at the bottom, you can still use the leads. It's just when someone picks it up, they're aware that actually you're not getting any protection there. And that's it, it's a really simple process for screening the leads. So if that helps, then we um, make sure you save the extras so you don't irritate. Radiation Protection 101.